As an engineering student, I was always very interested in applying the learning that I was gaining at school to try and help the understanding of new animal behaviors of any kind. And then I started working with social insects and I discovered that there's, there's something extra about collective behaviors. And in fact, this is something that has been going on for quite some years now at the, the MOBAS laboratory, which designs all kinds of robots that then interact with animals or social animals um, to try and reveal mechanisms behind uh, behavior. And this is just one of those robots with which we study um, honeybee collective behaviors. And in fact, when we study those behaviors, we often try to link with the grand public and not just any scientist. And here, our way towards doing this was the construction of a flexible structure that is supposed to represent the circadian beating of a uh, wintering, overwintering colony, where winter bees group together to form this tight pack called a winter cluster. Um, but then they, they, they break cluster during the day to feed on the surrounding um, honey patches and then they group back together during the colder night times. And this is something that we've been trying to represent with this organic motion and structure.